kiddos! In this video, I will be doing today's religion lesson with you. So as you know, this week we are learning all about Mother Mary. Uh, yesterday we talked about how when Mary was born um, and how God already knew from the moment that she was born that one day she would be the one he chose to be the mother of his son. Um, yesterday during our Zoom meeting, Ivana showed us that beautiful picture of the Blessed Mother Mary um, that was from Iraq. Um, and so here we have another picture of Mother Mary. <clears throat> Excuse me, and there she's holding the baby Jesus. And it says here, Mary the mother of God. God chose Mary to be the mother of his son Jesus. We call Mary the mother of God. Because we know that God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. It's all God, just in different forms. Um, Mary is very special. Mary cared for Jesus. And Jesus wants Mary to love and care for us, too. He gave her to us as our special mother. And she loves us and cares for us. Mary prays for us. And she tells Jesus about our needs. We celebrate the solemnity of Mary, the Holy Mother of God, on January the 1st. So boys and girls, when we pray, we should only pray to God, because only God can answer our prayers. But the reason why we say the Hail Mary, or the reason why we talk to Mary, is because we are asking Mary to pray for us. So we say, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. So Mary is not God. She is not the one that answers our prayers. However, she is the mother of God. And so when we talk to Mary and tell her our needs, she then talks to Jesus and lets him know our needs as well. So number one on page 359 says, how do you think Mary took care of Jesus? Draw a picture that shows her helping him. So Mary, mother of God, is our mother too. And she loved her son, Jesus, and she loved him from the time he was a baby up until, um, I mean, she still loves him today, but she loved him up through his whole life, even when he was a grown-up. So in this box, you can draw a picture of how you think she took care of Jesus when he was a child, okay? And it can be anything you think. There's no wrong answer. And then down here, it says, Mary is your mother too. So name two ways that Mary can help you. So on the line, you can name two ways she can help you. And I told you that some of those ways, um, she can help us by loving and caring for us. She can help us by talking to Jesus about our needs. So go ahead and write a couple things down on those lines. Draw your beautiful picture and continue to um, just show that love and respect for Mother Mary. Because how amazing that she's the mommy of our Lord and Savior. All right, boys and girls, have a great day. Bye.